America, we need to establish tiny homes enough for all people to live in. When I say all people, I mean all of these homeless people that are out there, people suffering from addiction, people suffering from poverty, people who are disabled and victims. We don't need traditional single family homes. We don't need large occupancy, high occupancy uh, tenements and apartments. For these people we need tiny homes which are cost effective and sustainable you could put them in large lots on big tracts of land and have a shuttle service or something like that that helps to transport people and their groceries and other things that they need to live in their tiny home this is a social safety net this is something that needs to be established nationwide and worldwide this needs to be done because <clears throat> there are so many homeless people and people who cannot afford housing living on the streets and having to live in broken down cars and things like that that are not optimal for living in to begin with I know what that's like I've seen it. I experienced chronic long-term homelessness as a child. And I know what the housing crisis looks like today because I've met people who didn't have a place to stay. I was fortunate. I had income for at least a fixed period. And even though I had lost my spouse and we, we lost our home to foreclosure, I didn't end up completely homeless. There's being in transient housing and being in places that are short-term leases and then there's homelessness. And the tiny home solution is an excellent solution for sustainably sourced housing for these people who don't have a place to stay. And that doesn't even cover people who are victims of crime, like domestic violence or sexual exploitation or sexual abuse. But I have suggestions for that as well. 